Perfect. Perfect. Rich Paul connects this with the John Wall situation in Houston, who is being paid by Houston while sitting out the season, even though he is healthy enough to play. John is able to play, but Houston is okay using the CBA to pay him and not to play. So which way is it? John is perfectly healthy and ready to play. It's okay in the CBA. We're being professional with both instances. By the way, he represents him. But how can it go both ways? John and the Rockets have been professional about their situation, and we are also expecting the same with the Sixers. Let me tell you something, Rich. (laughs) Number one, this has no correlation with John Wall. None. Why? Oh, let me tell you. Houston is in a rebuild. John Wall is being paid $44 million a year. They obviously don't want him. You know what they did? They met. They made a public statement of what they were doing. They actually cooperated. I am so sorry that you sit here and don't want to play anymore with a team and just demand your way out, and we're supposed to just follow every step down the route. We're supposed to just do everything that you say, right? I mean, stop it. Stop. This is is insanity. This guy has lost his marble. He thinks he is floating on top of the world. This has nothing to do with John Wall. And you know what? In that case... Houston didn't want him to play. Houston is a rebuild while the Sixers are trying to win a championship right now with an actual great talent like Joel B. So I'm sorry we didn't just cave into you and say, you know what, that's okay. That's okay. You can just do whatever you want and uh, we'll trade you wherever you want to go. We'll get back whatever we want. And unfortunately, it's come to that point. I mean, it, the fact that this guy... Talking about them cooperating with the CBA. I I just can't believe this. I can't believe that this guy, Rich Paul, is actually spewing this stuff out of his mouth. And then you got people on TV trying to defend it. And and shout out to Kendrick Perkins, who actually held his ground today against Windhorse, telling him, you know what? Nah, like, all we've asked for is communication at this point. That's all we asked for. We're all grown men, said Kendrick Perkins. Right? Aren't we grown men? Can't you come out and tell us and tell everybody what you want instead of letting all these stories go around. This is absurd. This is absurd. I'm sorry, man. I, I, it's just how I feel. And it's just not going to happen. It's just not going to happen. We have done everything we can to make this situation better. And y'all have not cooperated once, once this entire off season. I'm, I'm going crazy talking about this and, We just want to move on. We want to win a championship. Obviously, you don't care about that as much. And you see, I haven't even been talking about this because I don't care about it anymore. But when you see the thing is, Sixers fans, the organization, we're all getting a bad rep because of this guy thinking he owns the world. And that is wrong. What you are doing is wrong. Like, what kind of example are you setting for other people. How about young kids, right? When you don't like a situation, do you just crawl up in a ball, unravel, and and just quit? Is that what you do? And you expect to get everything handed to you? It's unbelievable. It is unbelievable, man. And that is my two cents on it. That is my two cents on it. The NBA will step in. I don't know what's going to happen here, but, I mean, just the fact of now blaming us for all of it Painting us as the victim. It's disgusting. And all I have to say is that I hope lessons are learned from this situation. I have never seen something this crazy in sports. I've never seen something this crazy. And I had to witness the Markel Fultz situation go down right in front of my eyes. We witnessed that situation go down. This is 10 times crazy. I've never seen something like this in sports. Maybe in life. This is actually insane. This is a game of cat and mouse. And um, people don't want to pick up their pride when they lose. (laughs) Like, it's, it's crazy, man. Perfect. Perfect. Perfect.